We go in there, we get information, go out and we use it every day. It was a very positive experience. The whole reason I'm in this field is because I'm inspired by human potential. At the Bowerman Sports Science Clinic, uh, we blend biomechanics research with application and exercise physiology research with application. This facility is named after uh, Bill Bowerman, the you know, legendary coach of the track program here for years and one of the co-founders of Nike with Phil Knight um, was Phil's uh, coach, well Phil's an athlete here as well. Some of the innovations that uh, Bill took on or, or brought into the world for track and field, a lot of it is on performance and on the physiology of performance, but then also on the mechanics of running with the ideas of shoe design. For the OTC Elite Athletes, the goal is to make world championships and Olympic teams and ultimately to medal at those. So we are trying to achieve a very high level. The Bowerman Sports Science Clinic is one major piece of our overall training environment here. Two thirds of your body mass is above your hips and then you're running on one of your legs at a time. And so that's pretty critical to get it right and most people don't. A lot of what happens at foot ground contact is due to what you've set up ahead of time in the hips. My name is Elise Wright. I'm a research assistant here at Bowerman Sports Science Clinic. Overseeing, running the physiology testing we conduct, it really helps us um, provide coaches and athletes alike very specific values, just a more realistic understanding of where they really are in their training. I did a uh, body scan, then I also did an aerobic threshold test, and then finally a VO2 max test take the research done by faculty here at the university and uh, translate it into practical purposes for athletes and for coaches, for physical therapists, uh, other clinicians that are in the area. And on the biomechanics side, we basically are analyzing the body as a mechanical system or an engineering perspective. And on the physiology side, we're analyzing the body's ability to perform under stress or under uh, endurance capacity and looking at how the body metabolizes its energy. Uh, or where does their lactate ions accumulation in the blood uh, happen so quickly that they can't metabolize it away. So normally you're producing this ion all the time, but you just metabolize it and you, you never notice it's there. But when it accumulates so quickly that you can't get rid of it, your performance goes down. For anyone who's really you know, serious about performance, whatever that performance level is, uh, there are some great resources there. There is a better way to train and a smarter way, a more effective way. They were getting contacts from people in Kenya, of all places, asking for help. And uh, you know, our first thought is, you don't need any help, you're doing quite well. <laughs>